Good morning everyone. Another sunny day here in the Caribbean. She has a rose. We have a breakfast victim. You're gonna get some breakfast down this morning? Mm-hmm. So I'm absolutely starving this morning. To be fair, I've not had a great deal this trip. Um, I said last night that I've probably drank more than I've had this holiday, um, which is probably standard for most people that do Vegas. But um, I mean, don't get me wrong, we do love a good drink, but I love a good drink, but just not as regular as some people do. But saying that, we've had a good time so far, haven't we? Mm -hmm. So it's now Tuesday morning. We've got all day today, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday and then come back on Sunday. It's been a really good trip so far. Really enjoyed it. Still got, I think it was works out five days left. Just heading to breakfast now. I'll probably just get my standard unless there's anything on different. Um, what you fancying this morning? Mm -hmm. Might end up getting a bit of pancake action, that's my guess. But yeah. Off to the pool now, so we off to the pool, off to the restaurant now to get some breakfast. I will show you what we get in there. Catch you in a bit. So just come out of breakfast. I'm not gonna lie to you. I forgot to video it. So I had, I think they were called poached eggs on toast. Not too bad. I only had one though. And what did you have? You had poached egg toast and what else? Bacon. And a bit. Bit of bacon. What I will say is the bacon, it, it's not, as you can imagine, it's nothing like English bacon. It's it's like chopped up, like sliced, and it's all really, really crispy. I mean, you probably put, love that, don't you? Yeah, she, she loves crispy bacon, but it's not like in strips. It's, it's, I don't know, it's like you've put it through a blender and then they chuck it out. It's all in little chunks. So it's good to have some, uh, like a filling for a sandwich or something like that. But if you wanted like a bacon sandwich, like in strips, and you're not going to get that here. So, just heading back to the room now, get creamed up and everything as usual. Head down to the pool for a few hours, cool off, and then we will uh, have a wander as promised. I meant to do it earlier on in the uh, week, to be fair, but it doesn't really matter. It kind of breaks it up nicely. Because I've done two, two days now, maybe three days, where it's just yeah. been constant pool, so it'd be nice to break it up. Um, have a wander up there. Wander down to play a car and then as we come back, not, might nip into Yucatan and uh, have some dinner on beach again. Hoping there's a different selection to last time. But just want to catch that view one more time because we'll probably not head down there again if we, once we've been twice. So, yeah, looking forward to it. I will uh, get some more footage as we go on a wander. So, we're just leaving his room now, about to uh, set off to have a walk up and get some money changed um, head up towards real player car so I can show you around that I'm gonna get some dinner on beach at Yucatan so as and when I get some footage I will pop it in the vlog so we've just had a walk down from our hotel this is the player car that's opposite if you walk down literally if you can see them cars in distance that is our hotel so it's literally five minutes and then you've got a Starbucks which is right here and if you look round here, you've got a little plaza area. It's got loads of little gift shops. It's all done up because it's like been a Mexican day or something like that. You've got a, a little hut here that does all your excursions, which will be cheaper than your hotel, but I'm not saying don't book from to here. You've got all these little shops here. Uh, behind the stalls, you've got actual shops. And then if you walk a bit further down, there's a proper shopping centre. But I will, uh, I'll show you that when I get there. So we just had a further wander down into like plaza area. A little bit of a fitness centre. This is a bit more modern. Uh, we've got a bank in here, that's what we're looking for now. So a few shops, a few, uh, there's a liquor store. Um, some bags if you want it. Um, there's, I'm trying to have a look, there's might sell dresses and things like that. Most of the things out here though are in US dollar, um, which is good for us because obviously our money goes a bit further. So yeah, any more footage you're in here? I will show you. See, it's really quite nice in here. They've got the old like Camden Market umbrellas going off. There's a little ATM down there, but it's not working. You've got a spa here. And then as you walk along, there's a massive gym here. It's a massive studio that I'll be air -conned. 
Uh, it's called Bell Meter Fitness, I believe. So you can get a look inside. Looks pretty decent to be fair. So just heading back outside now to uh, try and find our way out. So catch you in a bit, guys. So we're just in this little bar. Uh, they've got a little map of where people are from, so as you can see, odd person from Alaska, the United States, quite a few from Brazil and Chile, but most of them is UK and Europe, France and um, Netherlands, they're big ones. But yeah, it's a cool little set around here. Got a little Mexican dude playing the guitar. So yeah, nice little place. So we've just come into Rio Playa Car. This is the other hotel that I talked about. Um, it's all part of your wristband, so it's a little bit more modern, I would say, than ours. But overall, they're not that. You've got your check-in over there. This is like a bar area. The one thing I do like about this is it's got like an infinity pool, but it's not a pool. It's just for sure. But as we walk through a hotel, I'll show you more. So you've got an Asian restaurant, and this is menu. It's open till them times and open on them days. So this looks like it's main restaurant. As you walk down, you got another Pepe's food. I think we're only on until we are out of Pepe's food. You've got a pool to your left, like a little bit of a bar here. It smells like the grill going off. A pool to your right. And there's a pool bar as well. So yeah, it looks good in here. So as you come down from the hotel, the difference with this one is you are on the beach. So nice view, a lot of seaweed today, it's very mucky, but yeah, it's lovely down here. So that is a little bit of a walkthrough of the player car. Again, only difference really between our hotel and last one is you're on the beach. Um, layout's a bit crappy, but we've got this view, so it depends on what you want, and it's a bit more expensive. So it's a real Instagram versus reality look at all seaweed. So because they're all seaweed, they've got this little tractor that comes and drags it along, but it's really quite bad at the minute. They're having, they're having a real tough time with all seaweed. It's, um, it's just they're really struggling with it, but it's really nice. So this is Mexico by the beach. down from player car you actually can walk all the way down um, to the Yucatan where we're gonna go. It's right here is the back of the um, Rio Palace which is the next hotel along. That's the one that's not included in the wristbands. And then further down you've got the Yucatan which is included in wristbands and that's where we're gonna eat. So yeah really nice walk it's nice and windy so a bit of a breeze. Shame about the city being a little, uh, like I said, it's a little Instagram versus reality. It's beautiful as you can past it. So next footage we'll get is we will uh, be in the bistro at Yucca. So just heading back to the room to get me uh, get my sliders back on, take my trainers off. Just one thing that's worth mentioning is they do have an ATM and an exchange currency booth in the hotel, but the exchange rates, as you can imagine, are poor. So they, at current time of speaking, so it's eighth or ninth of May. Um, it is twenty about twenty twenty pesos to pound in England, but. And it's 20 pesos to pound in the hotel lobby. But what you always find is, obviously in England, they need to make a little bit. So you always come abroad and get better. Um, but obviously in the hotel lobby, we didn't. We've had a, literally a three minute walk down Plaza and we've got it for 22. So obviously if you're exchanging a big number of cash, it's well worth taking a little wonder because even for us, exchange, exchanging what we've exchanged, 
we've saved 30, said about 30 quid, so it's well worth it. So yeah, just wanted to let you know that. So this is a little shot challenge to do. Look at all the shots lined up on
damas y caballeros, él es el señor Mr. Tino. Ahora, saludos, just you, del equipo de animación, from the entertainment team, señoritas, para todas las señoritas solteras, for all the single ladies. Señoritas, señoritas, you have to make a lot of noise, tienen que hacer mucho ruido, señoritas, señoritas solteras, single ladies, make some noise.
it is night time. We are just on our way for food. What night is it tonight? <laughs> steakhouse night. No, we are going to the steakhouse. We're going to the steakhouse. So, steakhouse tonight. Um, looking forward to that. Then it's grease night, which should be good. And then maybe nip into the nightclub for an hour or two after. We'll all see what crack is, but hopefully, well, I can't see, like I said, I can't see why we wouldn't get in steakhouse. It might be a 20 minute wait or so, but yeah, we're gonna try and get in and I'm looking forward to it. So I will, um, this is normal, this is first specialty restaurant that will be we're done. So and we're not going to head late because we're early in the morning to see no. some turtles. No, it's gonna be a mid it's gonna be a midnight midnight finish tonight, nothing like it because we're gonna see Turtles! Turtles. So yeah. Um we definitely not bring one home. So I've got some cool footage today as well from the um, pool bar where they did the short challenge. I'm gonna I'm gonna put it on <laughs> uh, my TikTok as well. But yeah, you obviously have it in the vlog. I'll just I'm not even gonna put a background music on it because I want you to listen to the atmosphere. Um, so yeah, I'll uh, show you what food they have in the uh, steakhouse. So tonight, I've gone for some lamb that I've half tucked into. There's some marinated chicken skewers, some chips, and some mini potatoes, like little roasters, but they've got a hint of spice in them. And she's gone for lamb, lamb fried onions, fried onions, some sort of taco, some chips, uh, some beef pocket, chips, mm -hmm. mayo, and Potato mm -hmm. with drinks of water, coke, and water, and a half drunk sex on the beach with extra grenadine. May I must stress, extra grenadine is the one. So, yeah, that's food tonight. So, we're just in um, Pasha Nightclub, and this is basically what it's like in here. Just on his way back to the room now. So obviously you saw what food we had. We went and watched the Grease show. That was really good, weren't it? Yeah, it was. They did a good job of that, so fair play to animation team. That's probably the first decent show they've put on and we're in night eight. Um, obviously we've had silent disco and everything like that, but they were obviously external parties. So, Elia's been teetotal all day. I've had a fair few drinks, but I'm feeling good. We've just been to nightclub, had about 40 minutes in there, had a boogie. And uh, now we're off back to bed, up at, well, my normal time, because I've been up early every day this week, but early for earlier, quarter past seven-ish, half past seven-ish, for an eight o'clock kickoff for the snorkeling with turtles. And swimming in caves. And swimming in caves, and I tell you what, it wants to be good for how much we've paid for it, because it's costing an arm and a leg. I mean, granted, it's a private, private tour, just us two, but still, it's very expensive. So, yeah, we've got some good footage today. Um, you'll obviously see the shot challenge that they do at the pool bar, and a uh, bit of footage of Pasha nightclub, and um, obviously standard food and a bit of bit of footage on beach. And uh, to be fair, we, we also got us um, walk through a player car as well. So today's vlog might be a decent one. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed it so far. Just heading back to the room now, it's what? It's midnight. So, you know, we've been out since what? Seven? Mm -hmm. So, good night all by all. I will catch you in the morning when we are up for the turtle swimming. Catch you in a bit.